Welcome to the gates of hell. I'll be your tour guide, Uncle Kova. How you doing, baby? We're gonna get naughty today. I got a fragrance in a new release that probably nobody has talked about, and I don't think anybody has gotten tagged as much on this item for me to purchase than anyone else in the fragrance community. Cause Uncle Koba's perf. Should give you a little hint of what this fragrance should be about. Let's roll my music so we can unbox Nasamato's latest naughtiness. Sexy motherfucker. <laughs> Peoples, you know who it is, it's your boy, c 3 u 3 to a Listen, I did a video a couple of weeks back about naughty fragrances, different names, bottle presentations, and this one I wish existed prior to me releasing that video because if I have to do an updated version, this has to be on the list. Now, this I purchased from Nasamato, this was not sent to me, this was tagged to me on Instagram, an obscene amount of times. This is like the strongest tape ever, jeez. Obscene amount of times. Yo, Koobs, you need to get this. Yo, this is wild crazy. Yo, check this joint out. So I went ahead to the Nasamato website and I ordered it. The fragrance is called Sado Naso, the phallic edition. Now, for those of y'all who are educated, me not being one of them, uh, phallic edition, well, will be revealed momentarily. Okay, there seems to be a little cliff notes in the back of Sadanaso. The bottle of perfume is part of the project Nasamato. There is no purpose in life beyond the pleasure of the senses. Seems like a journalistic confession. I have a secret desire that even I don't know about. As I am constantly discovering a new one, I think that secret represents the true future. Sounds like there's some skeletons or items in that closet. All right, so let's open this fragrance up so you guys can see why, if you haven't already guessed, had everybody tagged me on this shit. Funky presentation. It's dark, it's hard to see, but you guys can see that the little black bottle with some shimmery, some real fancy presentation here. And listen, at the end of the... At the end of the day, um, I mean, I'm definitely gonna, it's, it's me. It's, 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 I don't know why it's me. It's not really me. And this is a very false interpretation of what this looks like. I'm just going to be f abundantly clear. This in no way, shape or form, uh, really represents based on the tone of this. You'll see what I'm talking about. This is the Sadonaso Nasamato phallic edition. Yep, you guessed it. It's a dickhead. It's a full-blown Peter Top. It's a rocket tip. It is a black dickhead. And if they're gonna make it black, they should have made it, never mind. Nasa Mato Phallic Edition. Now you don't have to have the dickhead. I mean, they also throw in like most Nasa Matos with fancy caps. They have the regular cap in here that you can remove the dickhead and pleasure yourself however you choose. If you want, I don't know, sit on it fucking weirdo. Whatever you're into, you're Gucci. So this is the phallic edition by Nasamato. I'm not pointing this at my face because that's weird, but I'm definitely curious on what this shit's going to smell like. Is it going to smell like after pool chlorine? We shall see. I don't even know what the notes of this fragrance are. All it says here is flammable, which is what my urine used to feel like back in the days. And then I got an injection and it all cleared up. So let's take the dickhead off and let's smell what Nasamato Sadonaso smells like. Now, Nasamato makes fire fragrances. I'm a fan of the house for sure. They are pricey fragrances. I think this one all in all came out to like 230 bucks for an 30 ml, which is wild crazy. But the majority of it is because of shipping. This joint is overseas. I don't even think anybody in the US has this joint as far as distribution is concerned yet, or who's willing to carry a dickhead. So let's smell this fragrance and see if this shit is any good, or did I just spend $230 on a presentation bottle, which is most likely gonna be the case, right? Unless it's like a banger, let's see. Let me smell the dick. That's unusual. There's something a little funk in it. There's something a little like chocolatey, yet like dirty ball smell. There's, there's a funk in here. What is that funk? 
Nasamato, if you did, if you took a page out of this fucking vulva, there's, there's a funk in here. There's a weird funk in here. I'm getting kind of like creeped out by the funk. And it's a strong funk. There's something weird that's a little funky. It's like musty nuts. There's a little like woody slash chocolatey slash musty nut smell fam. Chill, I need to find notes. This is kind of, it's kind of creeping me out. I'm not gonna lie to you. Aren't any notes listed which is creepy? Not on the Nasamato website, not on Fragratica because it's a new release. There's no notes anywhere listed. I am creeped out. And one of the things that sketched me out even more was the fact that it said, uh, colors made different based on the naturals that are used in this, but naturals what? Were you milking some dude? I am feeling suspect. There's a lot of, there's a funk in this air right now that has me feeling some type of way. This has no mass appeal to it, at least not from my perspective. There's something subliminally all right, but my brain, there's already something like, it smells like musty nuts, bro. It smells like you've been playing basketball all day and the runway between your asshole and your ball sack, that taint section, was used here experimentally on that natural aspect. It's not bad, it's weird. And the fact that I don't know what the notes are, it just makes me a little bit more uncomfortable. This is very unusual. My wife is just gonna have so many questions when I get home. Erotic bottle, funky for any bottle collector. Um, does it smell bad? No, it's weird. And I don't know what else could potentially give me weird vibes. Yeah, it's there's a chocolatey, musty ball sack sweat, but there's something, I don't wanna say appealing and ball sack at the same time, cause I'm not on that type of time, but like for a billion dollars, I mean. Yeah, I don't, I don't fucking know. I don't know. It's not bad. It's creepy, it's a little creepy. There is a sweaty ball sack smell here. Is it a ball sprayer? I feel like if I don't take a shower today, I wouldn't have the ball spray. It'll smell the same. Bro, I think it's, it's a me fragrance. If I was being active all day and I'm a ball, I am the ball sprayer. I always spray my balls. But even at the end of the day, after a long active day, you have fragrant nuts, right? Your balls is smelling like colognes. So you're gonna have this middle ground of, of musty asshole runway mixed with fragrance. And that's kind of what I, it's a ball sprayer. It's a ball sprayer fragrance. This. Phallic edition, Sadonaso, it's a ball sprayer fragrance. Maybe this was subliminally made for ball sprayers. I love y'all mother sucks from the heart. I don't, I don't know. I'm confused. I went into this with no expectation and left confused as shit. Not about like my sexuality or anything. I'm just confused. I love y'all mother suckers from the heart. Let me know if you would buy this fragrance. Yeah. I'll see y'all bitches next time. You know who it is, biggest in the game. I'm fucking confused. Sit on it. Top of my mom's crib. Hey. It's lost since you never get in. It's lost since you would think that you.